Martin in the backfield just off to the right side of quarterback Conwell. Boyd in motion from right to left. Here's the snap and the pass downfield, far side intended for Colerich. And it is it is a, a completed pass and there's a flag on the play. The catch made by Colerich at the 40-yard line of Bethel Park. A major game for Upper St. Clair. There's a flag on the play. The pass play of, uh, what, 40 yards? Just, just short, maybe 39? 21, 20, 39, absolutely. And then we're going to wave the flag off. They would have took the completion anyway, but Craig Colt, it's great job. There was great coverage over there. He just fought for the football, wanted it more. And that is a huge complexion turner because if you're stopped at an incomplete pass, the clock would stop. The Bethel Park would get the ball back uh, with still two timeouts. But give credit to the Panthers and especially Craig Colditz. He did a great job to go up. That's just one two on making that reception for Colditz. Just his just fourth reception on the year. One right now. First and two. Want to go with the play of the game first? Let's do that. The Pennsylvania one call that changed the game. Third and 15, but a tremendous 39 yard pass to Chris Colditz down the far sideline. Mm -hmm. Kept that drive alive and. Uh, they ended up going seven plays and 68 yards. Another touchdown by Dakota Conwell capped that off. But if Bethel Park holds upper St. Clair right there, maybe they get good field position. Maybe they get back in this game with a score. But the cold it's, uh, reception from Conwell kept it alive. And uh, then they scored a touchdown. And we're never really in doubt the rest of this contest. And that uh, Conwell to cold it's hookup is our call or choice for the Pennsylvania. One call that changed the game. Always call.